These place value arrow cards really help uh, children to understand the idea of some place value partitioning or splitting numbers according to place value. Now you can see here that I've uh, chosen uh, to make a number. The number is going to be 84,387. And you can see just by overlapping cards, one on top of the other, that you create the, the number. So there's the 84,000. There's the 300. There's the 80. And there's the 7. Now, later on we can link decimals into there, but we'll just stop here for the moment. Let's just think about this number. Let's just pull off the 387. 387 is 300 and 80 and 7. But it's also 380 and 7. And it's also 307 and 80. So you can see how just by using the arrow cards, it helps you to really split numbers up a little better and helps children to appreciate that. Once children are familiar with whole numbers, we can extend the use of these place value arrow cards into decimal fractions. So in the first case here, we can see the uh, green piece there. Now, some people might refer to that as uh, 0.5. It's really referring to 5 tenths. Likewise, that uh, some people might refer to the blue piece as 0 0.02. It's really referring to 2 hundredths. So when we put these pieces together, we can create a number now. And we look at this one here. This one sits on top like this. You see how the decimal point shows in there. And so now I have 87 and 52 one hundredths. So you can see it's, uh, we could refer to it 87.52. We certainly would not refer to it as 87.52. But preferred way of speaking or talking about that number would be 87 and 52 hundredths.